Hey guys, it's me again, Riz Grastar, and we're going to continue playing Resident Evil Revelations here, so continue. Also, I have since started the editing process on, like, the last session's video. Previously on Resident Never mind, Evil I don't want to interrupt, hold on. Hopefully remember. Hey. It's you, isn't it? It's Raymond! Cadet? No, I can still fight. That's the spirit. Uh, I guess you thought of everything. But even the FBC may not be able to cover its tracks on this one. Mmm, evil dude. Let the heavens scorch the earth with justice. Rack in the city all over again. And Teregrigis, no more. Looks like we both were too late. Both of you, <laughs> look. This is that weird shrug. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Abandon hope? He's quoting Dante. I'll find you, Jill. I promise. That's right. So all I was going to say was I started editing and I apologize if the video quality isn't amazing. I don't know what I can do about that. If you haven't noticed, awesome, keep it that way. Um, if you did notice like me, um, hopefully it's still watchable. I mean, I think it's I think it's still watchable, but I know that it could bother some people. So apologizing for that. Episode four, A Nightmare Revisited, go. You can strafe using AD. Yeah, you can, but you go stupid slow when you do that. So they quote Dante, and they're from the Inferno. We killed these bastards already. Apparently not. <laughs> it looks like you missed a few, and they're on this ship. And now they want to use the virus to stage another attack. They seek the truth. Pretty par for the course, I feel. And vengeance. Cool. Look at this. The whole ship's out of power. Yeah, I imagine that. On emergency power. But the comm system needs the main power. We need to bring the engine room back online. He doesn't like when I point guns at him. <laughs> I mean, I don't blame him, but that's funny. Safety procedures. Because this vessel was involved in a prior accident, safety standards that go beyond those outlined in the Maritime si Maritime? I don't know. Safety Act have been introduced. All crew must read and study this manual to be prepared to act in case of an emergency. 1. The Queen Zenobia has two unique power generators. If the main power genera generator should fail, the backup generator in the bilge will compensate for its loss and supply the entire ship with operating power. 2. This ship contains vertical and horizontal bulkheads that automatically divert water in case of flooding. In the event of an emergency, the bulkheads can be operated by the control system in the bilge. This system will continue to operate even after sustaining minimal damage. So do I have to go and operate that then? I don't know, but I'm gonna grab things. Cool. Things have been grabbed. So I'm glad we have our, like we have two pistols, but we only have one equipped because it looks like you can only equip three weapons at a time. Aside from uh, three guns, three firearms. So I have my pistol, the one I started with, the shotgun, and the sniper. And I was thinking too, right now I have like a 10% damage boost on the pistol. Take it. We might need it. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Anchor key, cool. Um, but yeah, if I get, so like, Hush. Shut up. I'm talking to my But tell me something first. You didn't see any other FBC members here, did you? Nope. I can't reach my partner Rachel. Damn it. That sucks. I heard from her since you went to the village. Maybe I shouldn't have separated. Anyway, right now I have it on my pistol and it gives again, I think a 10% damage boost, which 10% of like 100 is 10, you know? But if I put it on my sniper, that would be an increase of like 100 damage. So I was thinking that might be more worthwhile. Should we look for this Rachel Some to one? consider for the future. But after we bring back the ship's power. Which Oh, is it that way just under the stairs? Sorry, um, I realized too last time, in last recording session, I mentioned my map a couple times, I think. And uh, that's under my head where I've been putting that, you know, just up in the top right corner. So, whoops. Uh, but know that there's a map there. And there was like a little glowy orange dot when, you know, like at this door. So that's why I came here. Because <laughs> I trusted it and I was right to do so. Don't like these loading screens. I mean, you know, 
loading screen. It's clearly loading. I'm calling it a loading screen, I don't know. Well, here's the casino. The power's out. <gasps> Do I shoot it? Pro I probably don't shoot it. Yeah, I don't shoot it. <laughs> Can confirm. Alright, so I need... I mean, I don't know, I need power, but I guess to... Oh, hello, you're totally a person. Please use coins. Nice. As opposed to what, I wonder? Oh, I have to use a coin to get in? I see, okay. I can use the breaker to restore power to the casino. Dope. <laughs> Let me do that then, yeah. Here we are at the casino. So now I need to go and get that coin, which I guess is in the pond ship. now. Like are these like, are these gonna eat me? Press the button. Yeah? Holy shit, it's been infected. Watch up. Maybe I shouldn't have pressed that button. I saw these in the video. Ah, I'm reloading. Okay, that wasn't too bad. What? Oh, he ate the coin. That's good, because I was like, I don't want to reach into the infected water. All right, well, I guess then we have our coin. Let's move on. I mean, maybe there's like, is that ammo? Is that a thing? Yeah. Oh, handgun ammo case. Yay! Wait. Oh, was that for my... It might be for the other handgun that I picked up. Because this did... Well, I say this didn't change, but, like, it was just a case. It's not more ammo, so... How do I check that again? Was it F2? 120. Well, dang. That was, like, a 70 increase. Impressive. Oh, right. Sorry. Coin. Here you go. Ah... Oh, I didn't get a gold one? Alright. Yes. Oh, want another coin? Did did she steal my coin? Okay, no. That's just not the right coin. I see. Do I have to actually play one of these games? Like this one over here is lit up. So I can get more coins with this? Presumably. Inserted coin. Yep, it did it for me. It didn't even give me an option. I got one coin back. Okay, cool. Do I do it again? I mean, I'm not stopping it, by the way, when it stops things. It's just doing that on its own. Okay, no, that did the exact same thing. So I'm thinking, like, same results, same order. Maybe I have to just do it on a particular machine, yay. Oh, I'm full, right. So we'll see. Yeah, was that? Picked up bundle of coins. Dope. Let's go and try these now. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I mean, it seems like whether I'm, I'm weighing something, right? Because when I was putting like the bronze coin down, it was what, seven grams? But I don't know what you want. Oh wait, actually, do you have anything on your person that might? Looks like these things got a weight requirement. Yeah, I'm aware of that. No, there's nothing on her. I just wonder if I'm supposed to guess, like, cause, or if I, I'm supposed to have seen the requirement somewhere. Because right now it just feels like I would be brute forcing it, which is fine. Like I don't mind doing that, but. <laughs> Um, but I wonder if I'm missing something. Oh, there's this thing. Hold on. What are you? Casino staff's report. 
I finally found out how to bypass the security on the VIP room. The room is reserved for all the high rollers, so I've always been curious what goes on in there. It's so easy, all you have to do is feed coins to the casino girl next to the door and you can bypass any security. You have to hit the precise weight, 107 grams. A small price to pay for access to the VIP room. 107. I can do that. I could do 107. So, let's go do 107. Okay, so then if we... Dang it. Um, I mean, I said I could do it, not that it would be easy. Uh, yeah, I keep getting like 106, 108, like so close. Just not quite. There it is, 107. 324, now I know. Cool, we did it. And thankfully, that didn't take too long after I <laughs> I went to skip ahead, because I was just starting to walk around with this scanner, basically. So I was, I was heading down the stairs, and that's just when I saw the folder. Because I was, like, paying more attention. You know how it is. A scribbled memo. Dearest friend, I am at my wit's end. I am sorry, but I must go on ahead. They are sleeping, but they will wake up eventually. Now is my chance. Just thinking about them makes my hair stand on end. Their ugly bodies are not of this world. Their stench like rotting organs, and their screams like echoes from hell itself. I'm so frightened that I can't stop shaking, even now as I write this. Be careful. The bloated blisters on the walls are their eggs. They can regenerate from them, that's gross. Please don't think that I've abandoned you. I did it for my family. I will pray for your safety. Dearest friend. Also, do I need a... no. Don't need to reload anything. Cool. Also, I got the whole magnum, like one magnum bullet. I don't think I have a magnum yet. And I just want to see here really quickly if it's possible to remove these things. Yeah, it is. Let's burst. Two consecutive shots with one trigger pull. That's interesting. Um, yeah, because I'm thinking like, if I modify, no, that, thank you. No, go there. Modify. Because then, yeah, if I increase the damage, it'll go from 1100 to 1200. Like, it jumps a whole 100 points of damage, and that's awesome. Now, like most zombies, I don't need that much extra damage. Like, one headshot would kill them anyway, but maybe now a body shot will. Or, if nothing else, the sniper will be like, it could be my boss weapon. You know, because it's just so powerful. Where, like, one shot from a sniper would equal, like, 10 equally well placed shots. Um, from, you know, pistol. You gross, is one of these things. Oh no, it's another one. What do you mean target not found? It's, um, okay. I'm <laughs> looking right at it. Anything at the top? No, surprisingly. I mean, there's... Oh, okay. Weird. Guess it's just for the lamps. Here's the cool. I hope it still works. Making progress. Um, is there any... Like, can I do this? I can do this. Here. I don't know how... The key to start up the lift is missing. Oh dang. Then we need to find it. Okay. I'll check around here. See if it turns up. I guess it was a good thing that I started going down this way anyway. Another light thing. I assume that's what this puzzle is. They all seem to be the same so far. I mean like different solutions. But like the same process and whatnot. So no, sorry, you go back there. And then I want you. Like that. <laughs> Alright, and go. Oh, is this another? Oh, found another lift. Oh, only one option. Up. Cool. Down is my shotgun. 
and then pistol you. Didn't Raymond say his partner was in the bilge? Yep. That means Rachel or whoever has the key. We just have to find her. I think I might have an idea where she is. That corpse you ran is it earlier? here? Yeah. I just pray it wasn't her. Stop moving. Don't come closer. You cut that out. I gotta reload. Hold on. They walk in such like dumb patterns sometimes. Quickly before he melts. All right, the deed is done. And we continue on. So he came from here. Oh, he was just chilling in nowhere, I guess. Cool. It's a lot of this kind of just blocked off stuff. Which is not surprising. You know, a good way to force the player onto a particular path while still making the world seem like it's relatively open. Cool. And here. Okay. Reload! 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 Oh. That was good enough. I don't regret that extra bullet. I was playing it safe. It's like double tapping, you know? We're good. Um, it's out of order. Dang. Couldn't tell. Okay, hold on one sec. Right, we're good. Um, there's still power here. Yep. Is that the only reason they have soda machines so we can tell that there's power? Because that was the indication the last time, I think. Or like you know, near the start of the game. Anything in here? Nope. Can I even access? No, but it's blocked off. Okay. Did you hear that? That was weird. Okay. What? What did I just scan? Oh, was it this? I assume so. All right. Cool. Ah, okay. None of that. Is he... Is he gonna, like, break open the door? Oh! It just lets me walk in now. Okay. Well, I didn't know it was gonna do that. <laughs> that got me. That dummy of Chris. Yup. Where is the real Chris? Well, I say yup, yeah, but like I thought I'd recognize that other room as where there was that one cutscene where he came out while we were pulling up the gun with the arm and he saw my butt. I don't think I said it though. Mr. East instructions. It looks like a message. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> it is essential that we carry out our mission as expeditiously as possible after boarding the Queen Zenobia. Our two targets will be here soon, but they must not compromise the mission. Take appropriate actions. Don't overreact. One, securing the room. Find the most accessible room in the crew's quarters and secure it. Intel indicates there could be BOW. Activity on the ship. <laughs> Act with extreme caution at all times. Two, materials. The spy props you were given are meant to be used to sow confusion among our targets. Follow the instructions for where to distribute them around the room. After that, leave excuse me, leave the room immediately. Do not leave any traces of your presence. The main point of this mission is to mislead the target, so it must be carried out quickly and stealthily. <laughs> Do not let the target see you. Do not engage or fire upon them. Your primary concern concern should be your concealment. Leave everything else to me. Oh, cool. An item from my wishlist is apparently on sale. Thanks, Steam. I kind of... I'm, like, semi-expecting something, so I kind of have to keep an eye on my phone just in case. 
some people are just like super flaky and won't tell me for sure if they're gonna message or when they're gonna message you know how it is but it's important so I, do, I wouldn't want to miss it do I go to nope still don't go down right it was broken broken not just blocked No. Dead? Dead. Okay. Scanning the corpse. Got one point. Nice. Can I get another bit of ammo? Yeah. You're still there. Awesome. Because, like, they only, you know, they're only giving me one point for the scans. But they still take, like, just as many bullets to kill, basically. It would be a little bit better if I hadn't taken off the damage thing. You're absolutely right. But I did take it off, so what do you do? Ah! No! No! None of that! Reloading crap. Still alive, what the heck? Quickly reload. Now he's dead. Jeez. This guy's a little more powerful. And a little cooler. And their attacks are much more deadly, it seems. Okay. So I guess I'll just continue on. I mean, like, part of me would question that I'm going the right way, but we keep encountering all these new enemies, and so, like, I must be. Oh yeah, I forgot there was this door here the whole time. <laughs> That's correct, machine gun ammo, but I don't have a machine gun yet. I will soon, I imagine. We're gonna fight a boss in this next room, aren't we? It's like, we got ammo, we got a grenade, r r health. And we've been looking for Rachel this whole time too, so. Hey, look at that, change weapon. Um, we'll try it for now, sure. We know I just have to, okay, hold on. Changing weapons, when you change your weapon, it will automatically be available for retrieval from any weapon box. Weapon box locations are displayed on, okay, so I can, I can just get that from like here. Okay, I can, that's good. It worried me when it was just like set down, but why does it say out of 26? I don't know if I like that. I'm just gonna grab that again. Why does it say out of 26? Hold on. That doesn't... Did that just like bugger all of my... all of my capacity increases that I picked up? No, it still says out of 120. Oh, do I only have 26 total? Is that what it is? Okay, that must be all it is. Okay, so it's not out of 26. I just only have 26 right now. Okay, that's fine. It was concerning, but it's fine. I will try the machine gun for now. I didn't miss anything in that room, right? No, I don't think I did. So that's all the Iron Anchor room is for. Are you outside? There's a cold draft coming from outside. All right. Yeah, so we're totally going to have to kill Rachel here. Assuming that that voice is, you know, Rachel's. Gonna say that we're probably fine in this room. If there's ammo, though, I'll take it. Or hand grenade, sure. Yeah, because like at this point I could use more handgun ammo and such. Um, I think it was going this way. Rachel! 
It was around here. Rachel. <laughs> you here, girl? It's saving. Am I just here for this? Let's see what this is. No clues as to who left this note. I was forced on this mission. I had no desire to come here for a job that could get me killed. At any rate, stage one is complete. I got the key for the freight lift. Now I can access the bilge. It's Rachel. Probably. This ship was used as the base of operations for the terrorist attack on Terra Grigia one year ago. I found the UAV in the ship's foredeck that was used to disperse the virus. Finding the UAV was good. Getting attacked out of nowhere by an ugly monster was bad. I knew this mission would suck from the moment I took it. My head feels like it's going to split open. I lost an eye already. Oh, it's hard to see. I feel like crap. Arms are starting to feel weird too. My right arm split into two. Hmm. Blood all over my body. Can see my bones. Need doctor bad. The writing is obscured by blood. Oh dear. Hey girl. You're not gonna, you're just gonna. Bye. I found the target. She's a zombie. Isn't that always the case? Well, time to snipe her. That that was snipe her, for the record. Girl. Get to run, jeez. <laughs> Wait, no fair, you got a friend. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, let me go, let me go. <laughs> That's not fair, you can't run that fast and expect me to beat you. Yeah, I'm sure it does. Maybe you shouldn't gotten caught by a zombie thing. I mean, when I get caught by a zombie, I have to redo stuff. We know, don't. I'm not going in there. But I'll go to the other ducks. Look, I found more ducks. Yeah? Not Okay, I'll find others. Whatever. I'm not climbing in there, though. Hey, girl. You here? Wanna find me again? Don't. No. No. Stop that. Where do I have to go to find her? <laughs> I mean, at this point, really, I'm waiting for her to find me. That's what you get! That's what- Oh shoot, no, wait! <laughs> I thought you would stumble back or start running away or something. Something that makes me feel cooler. Nope. Just gonna run a moment. We know. Okay, I think once she jumps, she's invulnerable. Bye then. Her vocal cues are all messed up, too. I don't love it. I like you vaguely get an idea of where she is in relation to you. But, like, it's not as good as it should be. You jerk. I'm going to assume I just keep going back the way, though, that I came. I'm hoping it'll just take one more. Like, I wonder if she runs off at a certain amount of damage. Or if it's like time. Yeah. Don't do that. Did I get her? Nope. 
These random douchebags like sitting around waiting for me too. Okay. We got we got to be close, right? I got my shotgun for this next part. I don't remember this dude, honestly. What a way to go. Um, this door. Why not? You in here, Rachel? I got some soda. I mean, you know, define okay. Jeez. Oh, Ow. That's not what I meant. Did I? I pressed F. I got an achievement for that, I'm pretty sure. Like, how much do I have to shake the bloody mouse? Come on! She has so much health. Partner, can you bloody take care of that other guy? Holy balls! Finally done with that part? Oh, I forgot I have the machine gun out now, instead of the pistol. Oh my gosh, that took all five of my health things, and I'm still like critically injured, and look how much ammo it took too. All of my sniper, all but one of my shotgun. <sighs> that was dumb. That was so hard. So it really was Rachel. You know, like, please scan <laughs> Okay. That was stressful. That was really stressful. I'm glad it's over. I don't think it should have been that hard. And, like, I'm sure other people would have had a much easier time than I did. I don't know if the machine gun's good for me, either. Because, like, I'm gonna, like, just eat through that ammo. Still out of order yet. Okay. Where'd I come from again? I don't know. It's it's so hard. It's harder to see too when it's like this. I'm not a fan. Queen Zenobia, yep. I mean, I have the lift key, but like, where did I come from? I don't remember where the lift is in relation to this. Parker, do you know? Maybe I should use the map. So if I go through here, and then if I go through this door, how do I get to that door? That right there. Is that completely blocked off? Um, no, no, it's not. Okay. There's nothing in here, right? Okay. Ooh, I'm still just like kind of tense and a little frustrated about that part, but it's over with. It's in the past. We can move on. Just like, mm. I guess one of the things that I don't love about things like that, you know, when they're like that strong and that mobile and everything, like she, she was able to move so fast, right? And even if I got a headshot on her, it did- You're dead. You shut up. You're dead. 
I killed you. Anyway. Um, like, don't you dare. This mean don't you bloody dare. <laughs> um, or something like that. What was I saying? Like, even if I got a headshot, it didn't guarantee that she would, like, falter and stumble back, right? And so it didn't seem like it was a matter of skill, necessarily. Um... And then she was able to just move, and because like the knockback isn't guaranteed or whatever, and she was able to move so fast, like I cannot get away from her, you know? Like if I'm moving straight, this is the fastest I can be. If I'm trying to strafe at all, I just immediately start walking, which is I think really dumb. Like why can I not strafe while moving at normal running speed? Um, and then like even if I hit space to quickly turn around, what? It's like that, there's still like a half a second delay before I can start moving. So, bleh. Oh, and especially if I'm, like, aiming to actually fire, I move even more slowly. So it's just a whole mess. This is a whole mess. Okay. No, oh, then here. <laughs> it's like, now what? I will acknowledge the dodge feature. But even then, I still think it's dumb. Because, like, you... Dodging is, like, very precise. That part does take skill, for sure. It's very precise, and you dodge a certain way, and so, like, you might end up cornering yourself even further. Things like that. Yes, I did interrupt his super BA little line there. I don't care. Episode 4, A Nightmare Revisited End. Oh, that didn't seem like a long episode, at least. Or maybe I'm crazy. No deaths, though. Look at that. No deaths. It only took me five herbs. <laughs> All five. Ah, oh, man. It's things like this that make me hate that, like, five herb cap. Because, like, I found a number that I could have picked... Okay, I remember finding, like, two, I think, that I could have picked up. At least one! And I could have scanned more, I'm sure, for herbs. But because, you know, I was at the cap, like, I couldn't pick them up. But now I used them all at once, so now I have nothing! It's just item management, man.